Hello guys, hey there and welcome to SimuG. This is Cafe Owner Simulator, a game from Second Reality, developed by and published by Rock Game SA. Now these guys have actually released a few games recently, and if you're interested in this one, I highly recommend you check out some of their other games. Scrap Nought is a game that went down really well. Ninja Simulator was really well received. Yakuza Empire, another game that I think has got some pretty positive reviews. But the most recent one they've released is Technicity. And just having a little look at that on Steam myself, it looks fantastic. Now, if you know my channel, you'll probably remember watching Cowboy Life Progronk. That's by these guys as well. A really promising looking game which i don't believe has um released yet oh actually it looks like it's no 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 the prologue is still available it's free to play you can check that out another game that's coming out soon from the publishers uh which is well worth a mention i know i'm going slightly off on a tangent here but trust me it's worth it um it's called what's it called Pirate Commander, I think it's called. There it is. Pirate Commander looks really interesting as well. So I've got really high hopes for this Cafe Owner Simulator. This is a first look gameplay review. If you don't know what that means, it means I haven't played it already. That's why it's called a first look gameplay is because I'm going to play it for a bit. And then review basically means I'm going to share my thoughts with you about the game based on my many, 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 many years of gameplay experience and software development. So, um, one thing I always complain about is trees that move like this. This looks like we're in a hurricane, right? This is way too aggressive. This is horrible. That's my first complaint, and we haven't even got off the main menu. Let's go into settings and see what we've got. So we're running 4K 60fps. I'm only recording in 30, but that's because I've got a hardware limitation on my hard drive. Quality, quality so it is on ultra. Anti-aliasing is uh, doesn't matter because we're capped at 60. We're in full screen. V-Sync is on. Uh, oh, hang on. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Why can't I turn on anti-aliasing? Oh, I can. Okay, good. Hmm, that seems a little unresponsive. Click, click, double click, click again, click, 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 click. Well, I'm not sure if it's just really precise or whether there's a bit of lag. I'm not sure what's going on there. I think it's just a, a precision thing. You have to be right on it. Okay, mouse sensitivity is too English. Bum, I don't know what that means. Uh... Azerty, cockroaches, and invert mouse. Okay, that's that's weirding me out slightly. Cockroaches, not something I want to see in my cafe. But let's jump in. Let's jump in with a new game. Are you sure you want to start a new game? All save data will be lost. Well, that looks like I've played it before, but I guarantee you I haven't. You can see that the continue button is greyed out. So that's a bug. Just, just to clarify. Right. My father was in the restaurant business for all of his life. Every day after school, I would run into him at work and watch how he ran his business. He was a strict but fair boss. Which one Which which one do you think is his father? Do you think it's this guy or the twin behind the bar? Hmm. Wearing a different coloured cap, but the exact same identical clothes. That's kind of funny. It's kind of funny. All right. Business was going... Oh, it's him. It's this guy. Interesting. I wasn't actually expecting that. Business was going very well. My father wanted to open a second restaurant in the neighbouring town. Half of the money to open it had been raised, and he planned to borrow the other half from the local mafia. He'd been friends with their boss since college. OK, well, this game's just taken a total, total uh, trajectory change. My father borrowed money and opened a second restaurant. Unfortunately, it turned out to be unprofitable. For days on end, he searched for the reasons for its failure, but never found it. Over time, his health declined and he ended up in hospital. When he returned from hospital, he began to go over all of the bills that needed to be paid. He realised right away that he would not be able to pay them all. He didn't sleep for almost a week. Thinking about closing the business and retiring, the decision was made. My father sold the business, paid off the debts and retired. It was my 26th birthday. We decided to celebrate it in our favourite place. My father raised a toast to me and to his retirement afterwards he handed me an envelope i opened the envelope and saw a check for fifty thousand dollars now your dream is real son after these words i realized that my father knew that throughout my childhood i followed his work with burning eyes i was extremely happy and decided to revive the family business i'm not being funny this guy looks like a human this guy <laughs> 
What is going on there? He's a very interesting character. Okay. This may not be the hardcore simulator I was expecting. We may be um, fending off mafia advances and all sorts here. You know, cleaning, laundering money. That's what they call it. Laundering money for them. You never know. My hope is, my hope would be that um, I get to buy a premises or rent a premises, paint it, decorate it, furnish it, create a menu, serve the food I want, manage the um, uh, the ingredients and the uh, bills, the electricity, etc. Perhaps deal with difficult customers and machinery breaking, that kind of stuff, maintenance and so on. That's what I envisage with the, with the words Cafe Owner Simulator, but until you play it, you never really know what kind of game it's going to be. This is a very long loading screen. Very long loading screen, goodness me. Yeah, that's preposterously long. Should I pause it? I'm going to pause it and come back when the game's finished loading. Oh, that was painful as hell but we're finally there welcome to castle lake i hear you're planning to open a restaurant and motel here and motel interesting if so that's good news our town doesn't have enough places to eat and have a good time my name is dries owens and i'm the local sheriff if you need my help you could always call the police department good luck with your business and have a good day right well that's pretty much confirmed to me we're going to have some sort of mafia involvement in our our experience if in our uh, in our campaign let's say why have we only got seven thousand dollars what have we spent forty three thousand dollars on already i wonder oh look at that cat and what the hell is that there's a moose in the background bloody hell right so i get the impression we're in canada somewhere open 24 hours diner do you reckon that's our diner how do i get there then Oh yeah, I think we're going to have to clean up all this stuff. It's going to be a bit of cleaning, a bit of tidying. That is a very, very British uh, looking post box. Now, I've never been to Canada, but I, I assume that is something you would see in Canada? I don't know. I'd be interested to learn about that. Let's meander over here. An absolute tip, isn't it? This looks gorgeous, though. See, these trees... Better, but still a little bit wobbly. For my liking. Right, so I haven't really been paying attention to the screen. I do apologise. Tasks. Find the electrical box in the backyard and turn on the power. If you need portable lighting, you can find it in Tablet Av Av Avance Av Avasoni. What the hell? And then other. Task complete. Figure out how to enter the restaurant. Okay. I think we're going to have to clear some space. Or we'll clear some debris. Right, can't do anything else. Inventory. Tools. You can find them in the tool store in the tablet. To use them after purchasing them, open in the inventory by pressing F. I'm sure I saw a rat. Yep, there's rats. Okay, nice. Okay, nice. Let's begin, I guess, by getting rid of all this crud. place as cleared up as I possibly can. Now to remove leaves or moss, press F and take the rake. Okay. 
nice so you can right click to put tools away i like that that's a very smooth problem free thing the trash can is full order trash removal at tablet wow okay there's a lot of stuff here uh garbage removal it's going to cost me 49 dollars right so i have to wait for the garbage to be collected before i can clear any more garbage oh look at that he actually turns up he doesn't actually empty it does he no it's just a, a loading screen thing okay well that's that's all right Periodically, you can find metal cans. Opening them will give you a random cash prize and experience points. The, can be, the cans can be found on all game levels. Okay, so we've got game levels then. So if I go to my inventory... No. How do I... Oh, that's a Vonce. Okay. Um... Ah, there's, there's the can. How do I open it? Ah, I don't know. Alright. Clean up all the trash outside and inside of the building. Okay. Congratulations, your restaurant has been upgraded. Your reward money has already been deposited in your bank account as well as the new tablet. New tablet? Option. Wallpapers. Okay. Can. What do I do with the rats? Do I click on them or what? They're nippy little buggers. Ow! Ow! They literally are nippy little buggers. Okay. I gotta say, I do like the way that the tools work it's very quick to get them out it's very quick to put them away again who the hell's that guy he looks absolutely hammered <laughs> i guess we're going to go have to say hello i'm sure he'll give us some good tips all right Looking pretty good. We're getting there. <laughs> I didn't mean to click on him. He's left his cat behind. These neighbourhoods are inhabited by homeless people, just like everywhere else. From time to time, they may visit your establishment to ask for money, do harm, or sometimes just to observe. How you deal with them is up to you. Okay, that's pretty cool. This door is locked, so unlock it, go to Tablet My Restaurant. Tablet my restaurant oh okay to expand the establishment complete tasks take additional orders from cafe owners and earn money are you kidding me turn the lights on automatically switch on time 16 lamp off time zero okay that's a bit of a bug once you click turn the lights on automatically you can't untick it Okay, problem. Oh, I see. These are outside lights. Got you. Okay. Um, toilet rooms going to cost five and a half thousand dollars. Okay, but I can't do it. So when you complete each of these tasks, it's ten levels. You unlock a new thing. Okay. What about this door? No, that's also locked. Right. So, I'm going to have to get rid of those rats somehow. Hopefully the game will... Uh, explain that to me at some point. Yeah, I definitely like how you can right-click to remove stuff. I can't get rid of those. 
So I imagine that is something we'll unlock over time. Yeah, that's expensive. Um, oh, there's something can go up on the roof. Maybe not. Adjusting the exterior lighting. Turn on the outdoor lights or set the lights to turn on automatically. Go to tablet my restaurant. I've already done that. I'm ahead of you. Alright, we're getting there. We're making a difference. I suspected there would be a bit of clean-up to do at the beginning. I must say, although it's not realistic, I really appreciate the fact that you can clear up the leaves with just one click. In a lot of games, it takes like four, five, six, seven, or eight, you know, maybe even ten swipes at it. Uh, and that's fine, but, you know, I'm actually quite grateful that it's it's quicker than that here. Damn it, that's one way on it. It's not a problem because the tools are very easy to use and quick and responsive. Whoops. Task completed. Purchase a net at the tool store. The hell was that? Sounded like a B-17, that was cool. Uh, a net. Okay, the, the food store? No. Tool store. There we go. $120 for that. Let's get the mop as well. Right, so we've got the net. I'm guessing we're going to go rat catching. See how easy this is. Come here, you little git. Oh wow, I put the net away somehow. Got one. Two. There you go. Oh. This is not that easy. Got him. Woof. Restore everything that's broken in the building. Windows, roof, foundation blocks. To repair parts of the building, aim at the damaged part and press the left mouse button. Keep your building in good condition so that visitors have a good experience and leave positive reviews. Oh wow, look. That doesn't look broken at all until you sort of click on it. <laughs> that's weird. Okay. That's rather gimmicky. When it rains, there are always puddles. They can affect the impression visitors have of your cafe. Get a mop to clean up puddles after rain and keep your cafe clean and cosy. I guess that means clean up puddles inside that people walk in. Because otherwise it wouldn't make a lot of sense. Okay, I see a problem there. When you right click to close a message that comes up, if you've got anything in your hand, it also puts that away. Not a big problem, but something I noticed. That is broken, isn't it? It really isn't very obvious if something's broken or not. 
Okay, there's, there's another one. Right. Any more broken windows? Walk in fridge. Not much light in this restaurant, is there? It's pretty dark, really. Hello. There's a paw print outside. Or is that meant to be a puddle? Oh, it wants me to clean the puddles up outside. That is odd. I don't think anyone has ever done that in the history of cafe ownership. It's very strange. Right, so you have to left click to climb up on the roof, I see. Okay. Well, that's. <laughs> if only it was that easy, guys. Right, we've ranked up to level two. What? What's next? Oh, I see a puddle. Oh, I see more roof. And I see it upstairs. I didn't know there was an upstairs. Did you? I can't fix the windows from outside. Okay, so I have to figure out how to get in there. I had no idea there was an upstairs. Getting rid of puddles outside is definitely weird. What the hell was that? There's a... What the hell is that in the trees? Hi, this is Sheriff Drees Owens. Did you hear the news about the horrible monster that's roaming around? No, but I see it. Locals say they've seen a monster that looks like Bigfoot. We're getting a lot of calls about missing cattle. Also, there's a missing Alan Williams. His wife says he went hunting in the woods and never came home. The mayor promises a reward for information about the monster's whereabouts or his picture. A reward of 2000 if you can get a picture of him. Send it to us. Take care. He's right there. How do I take a picture? Camera. Camera's not unlocked. He's right there. How do I take a picture of him? That's weird. Yeah, I'm not a big fan of cleaning up puddles. I think that's rather daft. Right, how do you get upstairs? We need to, I think, achieve more stuff. How do you get upstairs? Okay, the walk-in fridge looks disgusting, but functional. Oh, that's to the stairs. That's toilets. I thought they were both toilets. Okay. That weirded me out as well. There's a cat out there. Right, restore everything that's broken in the building. Windows, roof, foundation blocks. Foundation blocks, okay. Maybe this will unlock the camera. I wonder if the uh, monster is... Sorry, Bigfoot is uh, aggressive or not. the wall covering or wallpaper okay so i think i do that in here right did i see it in here my restaurant let's go for something bright oh that's exterior walls i have successfully successfully painted the exterior walls but in my opinion the internal walls have also been painted 
That does look better. Ah, tablet Avancy. Oh, hello. All right. This is looking starting to look quite good. A little bit gimmicky, but at the same time, quite fun. Wallpapers. Let's go with... That looks to be the brightest, so I'm going to go with that. Oh, no. Instantly regretting that decision. But it is the brightest option, so I think it's the right thing to do. It's quite a dark, dingy restaurant. Uh, cafe, sorry. Is it cafe or restaurant? I'm not sure. Almost there. You do the roof as well? No. Not not with this setting, but obviously you can paint the roof too. It's kind of cool. It's going to look really good when it's done. I'm going into this. I'm enjoying this. It's not a simulator. It does frustrate me that games call themselves simulators when they're not simulators. But I'd say this was a simcade. You know, there are elements of simulation here. Overshadowed somewhat by... Uh, Muchos, muchos uh, arcadiness. Right, so I need to find other. other there we go. Smoke detectors, 50 bucks. Whoa! Right, so we have smoke detection here. Job done. Let's get to work on the menu. Open the tablet and go to menu and add at least five items. Have I got a camera yet? Still no camera. Okay, five items. I need to be level seven to have a camera and I'm level two. Good lord. Oh. We've just got a new kitten, by the way. I just thought I'd drop that in there as soon as I feel like I've just been attacked by one. See, already that's starting to look a lot brighter and nicer in here, isn't it? I think so. All right, so menu. The higher the price of the dish, the higher the net profit. But don't forget that the price affects the customer score. <laughs> this is what the bum is. Hey, manager. I used to have a restaurant and my staff used to feed the bums from the neighborhood. But when I lost it all, believe it or not now. Now I have become a bum myself. It's my birthday soon. Just remember that this month I want to invite my friends, Marco, John and Dennis. We want to buy vodka and delicious appetizers. Help set the table, my dear friend. 80 bucks. No, go away. He'll come back and he'll do something nasty to the restaurant, I bet you. We'll have to find the uh, police officer. We watch him. What's he going to do? That's quite funny. Do, do you remember we used to have bums on um, on uh, Bus Simulator, I think it was. Or was it OMSI? No, it was Bus Simulator. We used to have bums, drunks, on Bus Simulator and you never had to give them their change back. Why did they get rid of them? That was brilliant. It was so funny. Right. Um, what was I doing? The menu. Okay. So I'm quite happy with that, but I'm not happy with the fact that... Oh, oh, I see. To add or remove a dish, left-click and drag it. So pepper it. So we're going to have four cheese pizza. Hang on. We're going to have margarita, because that's what my daughter has. We're going to have... Where did the four cheese go? Four cheese. Pepperoni. Um, should we just be should we just be a pizza hut to start with let's not overdo it let's just 
stick to the pizzas, keep our life nice and simple. Now let's order food for cooking. Open the tablet, food store, and select food items. Okay. That looks like a Spitfire. How cool is that? And weird. <laughs> you could be nice to the cat. That's kind of cool. This game's really good. I really like this. I'm impressed so far. I really am. Uh, you have paid the employee salaries of zero dollars. Excuse my slurring. Um, right, food store. How do I know what the hell? How did you get in? Get out of here. Get out of here. Right. Um, let's get garbage removal. Let's get that done so it's done and clear. Uh, right, so if I go into menu... Oh, it tells me at the top, so I need... That's awkward. I need ketchup, I need whatever that is and whatever that is, but I can't hover over it to see what they are, so I just have to sort of guesstimate. That was one of them. If you bought a box of groceries by mistake or you don't need it anymore, you could throw it in the large trash can in the back of the restaurant. Okay. Okay. Uh, so that was one of the things. What was the other thing? Ketchup and what looks like dough. So we'll get some ketchup and dough. I don't see. Oh, there it is. Oh, hang on. It's, there's green things. I need to buy all the stuff with green on them. I, I see. I wonder if it's always going to help me that much. This indicator displays the foods that are needed to prepare dishes from your menu. Oh, okay. Okay. So that green dot had nothing to do with with anything. Or did it? I have no idea. Uh, and then place them in the freezer. Right, so the food delivery has arrived. The nasty Bigfoot has gone. Okay, so it automatically decides where to put it. So we've got some onions. I'm not being funny. Why did they put them there and not here? I think if I was if <laughs> if I was Dev Lead, I would say I'm sorry. These boxes have to be stacked up here under the thing so they're not out in the water. That's just daft. That's that's the hardcore sim in me. You see. I'd also argue that we need to get a pallet truck so that we can pick up at least three boxes at a time. Maybe that's something we can unlock later. I don't know. But one at a time is a real pain in the ass. I'm not super strong, but even I could probably pick up three boxes. Or two. More than one, anyway. Right, that's pretty much done. Find the puddles outside to be really weird. I think I'm just going to ignore them because I don't like it. Right, some equipment requires connection to an electrical outlet. Buy and install outlets and then connect the necessary equipment to them. Otherwise, you will not be able to fulfill the orders of your visitors. Oh, that's pretty cool. Okay. So, outlets. Kitchen. Selling special furniture, games, lamps, pictures. Mm -mm 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 -mm. There we go. Outlets. I'm going to put one on that wall. 
One on that wall. One on that wall. That may be a terrible idea. Place a cash register. Okay, I'm going to put another one down. Place a cash register, kitchen table, oven and refrigerator. Some equipment requires plugging into an outlet. Okay. Ooh. How do I rotate? Q and E. Nice. That's very cool. I'm, I'm very much liking that. Uh, do I? How do I connect it? That's awesome. I didn't know the cable would come out in the middle like that. Is that going to be a problem? I think we're good. I think we're good. This is so cool. What a cool game. Uh, okay. Um, kitchen table we didn't say anything about that refrigerator it's an oven okay so the oven it's a real old knackered oven that isn't it goodness me that's cool i like how things are individually plugged in that's pretty awesome um, the fact that you could just buy a power outlet and have it stuck on the wall, though, is a bit funny. Again, hardcore sim coming out to play. Um, right. Uh, what was the other stuff? Kitchen table, refrigerator. Okay. We did need a kitchen table after all. Probably could have position these better. If I click on that and say move, how far will the cable let me go? That's pretty good. And then a fridge. Fridge, fridge, fridge. Oh, that's going to need power. Alright, so we need another power outlet. Awesome. That's pretty cool. Okay. Place a kitchen hood over the stove and a sink, as well as two tables where visitors can eat. Okay, that could be a problem. Kitchen hood. Is that it? The ventilation hood? Right. Rather oh, feel I put those in the wrong place. Let's move it over to here. Let's buy another one of these. Now that's still plugged in over there. Is how is that gonna work? Oh, I can't do it because the uh, the fridge is in the way. Hmm. How do I unplug the power? Oh, okay. I'm not sure that's how it's meant to work, but we'll we'll go with that for now. We'll accept that. Right, so what hasn't got power? That hasn't got power? Okay, good. A sink. Mm, let's move this. Wow. 
we'll put a sink in kitchen kitchen sink Now I need some tables. Some equipment requires workers. To assign a worker to this job, first you need to hire one in the management section in the tablet. Then you will be able to select them and assign them to this menu. Okay. So, tablet management, hire an employee, choose the best workers so that orders are fulfilled faster and your visitors are always happy. Communicativeness influences the cost of your meals. The higher this indicator is, the higher the chance that the cashier will offer the visitor an extra dish. Motivation decreases over time. The choice is yours. Replace an unmotivated employee with a new one or pay him a bonus to increase the rate. All this affects the speed of work. So, um, pay a headhunter. That's got to be this guy, right? Clearly. Chuck. So I've hired a guy and then point the mouse at the workplace press left mouse button sign an employee or oh, I can't I can't do it because I'm not level 5 oh at the kitchen table I see Chuck Chuck it is cool Chuck's there awesome Install two lamps. Two lamps. So, lamps. I like these bad boys. I think we're going to have one of those here. One of those here. If you don't maintain a good relationship with local homeless people, they may hurt your business, like breaking windows or throwing trash on the gra cafe grounds. Sometimes they may ask you for money by telling you another story. To so give them money or not, the choice is yours. Here he is, grumpy guts. Right, what do you want, mate? What's up? You little git. Kick your ass! Kick you in the butt. You'll notice he's slightly less annoyed with me after doing that. That's a really cheap way of... Uh, I mean, that's not a big deal, is it? Take me half a second to fix that. No sign of any... Uh, Naughty uh, monsters type things? Nope, we're all good. Alright, we're getting there, we're getting there. Place two bio toilets outside. Are you kidding me? You have got to be kidding me. Oh my word. I cannot believe they're making us do this. This is funny. Right, open the restaurant and serve five customers. You have opened the restaurant. To move the equipment or to hire new workers, you need to close the establishment and fulfill all current orders. Then you can do everything you need. Okay. So am I going to be the cashier? How's this going to work? I do feel like we need some more lamps. Okay, can't even do that. Pizza carbonara, ten dollars. Uh, pizza carbonara. I 
Okay. Sometimes visitors can leave footprints on the floor. To keep it clean, buy them up at the tool store. Yeah. Roger that. So he's expecting his carbonara. There's another lady coming in. Oh, this is cool. I quite like this. And this guy's prepped it. He's now cooking a pizza in a pot. That's a smidge random. And we have one dish ready. Hello. Wow, she looks like a... Four cheese. Okay, uh, pizza. Four cheese. She looks like a proper chef. Show ready orders. Take the pizza carbonara. That looks like uh, pepperoni to me. He's quite happy. This is cool. We've got a pizza cafe. How awesome is that? That's pretty awesome. I wonder if I can... Oh, let me shut the shop before I can move it. Show ready orders. Take. There you go, madam. Enjoy your pizza. Congratulations, your restaurant has been upgraded. Your reward money has been deposited in your bank account as well as something or other. Where, why did he go? The rating of your restaurant is the most important indicator. It is displayed at the top of the screen as stars. The more stars, the more customers will visit. To increase the rating, keep it clean, periodically make repairs, serve customers faster. The longer they wait the cash re at the cash register the lower the rating they will leave. The tastier the coffee, the higher the rating, and much, much more. Maintain comfort. The more comfort items in your establishment, the higher the comfort. Good luck. So, I think that third guy left... Oh, there's the money, look. I think the third guy left because there was nowhere to sit. So, makes good sense. Oh, it's a carbonara. Makes good sense that I put another table down, I think. Ah, footprints. Cockroaches? Oh, how do I get rid of them? It's nasty. <coughs> oh, footprints. Right, F. Mop. I wonder if she'll let me mop while she's... Yeah, she doesn't care. Hello, sir. It's a bit rude to be on your phone whilst you're ordering, but okay. Pizza margarita. Whoa! Pizza margarita. Pizza carbonara, madam. Just inside the green. Okay, this is going to get annoying as hell. Now, see, now this guy's going to come in and leave, I think. Yeah, that's what I figured. <coughs> There's nowhere for him to sit down. I thought it might be that. So I can't order any more stuff. What have I got to do? I've got to serve five customers. That's it. All right. We can do that. It's not going to do it. We need some sort of spray, I imagine. Right. Pizza up. Have you noticed that all the pizzas look exactly the same? Not just me, is it? Now, is that lady going to get up and leave in time for this sprightly young lady? Yes, just in time. Uh, pizza country. That's a fairly new pizza to me, Pizza Country. Yeah, I'll just take that money, thank you. Alright, this should be the last guy, I think. Yeah. Yeah, grab the mop. This is um, this is really good. I really, I'm really enjoying this. Uh, show ready orders. Take that order. There you go, madam. Enjoy. 
Oh, congratulations, I accidentally clicked on something, so I don't know what it said. Now I've got to serve 20 customers. Sometimes natural disasters such as tornadoes or hurricanes occur. They can damage everything around you, including your cafe. After a tornado, take a good look around your cafe to see if your windows or roof are damaged, along with the damage tornadoes bring debris. Nice. Okay. Sorry about that, madam. Let me just fix that for you. Something's broken down there. Oh. Nice of you to come out during a tornado. Pizza carbonara. Have a seat, madam. Ignore the broken glass. Thank you. I've got to say, the frequency of um, footprints is a bit of a pain in the butt. Oh, hello, mate. What do you want? Go on, sod off. Word. Hello, madam. Sorry about the wait. Pizza margarita coming right up. There you go, madam. Enjoy your pizza. Sorry about the window. Let me just shake a window at it and get that fixed for you. Yeah, these are going to really annoy me. Technically, they already are. And, you know, I'm not being funny, but I don't think that was a tornado, but They're not very well constructed, these things, if they're going to fall off every time it gets windy. What is that? There's something up there that's broken. Oh, the roof. Right, okay. Well, this is getting pretty busy already. Sorry about the wait, madam. There you go. Thank you very much, madam. Just in time for this gentleman. Hello, sir. How are you doing? Uh, what do you want? Four cheese pizza. Seat, sir. Have a seat. And let's get some of this cleared up. Pretty non stop. Mostly that's a good thing. Thank you, sir. Come again. The dish ready. Just got to repair the roof real quick. Get the dish that's ready. There you go, sir. Enjoy your meal. Second time of asking. The flipping rats. That's not good. <laughs> Don't mind the rats, sir. That's perfectly normal. It's a pet rat. Hello, madam. How can I help you? Pizza margarita coming right up. Uh, yep, yeah, there we go. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you for your custom. Please come again. What can I get for you, sir? Four cheese pizza. Take more orders at once, buy more kitchen tables and hire employees. Oh, I see. You can only cook one thing at a time. That's annoying, isn't it? Apologies for the uh, delay, sir. Four cheese pizza. That's ridiculous that I can't take multiple orders. Pizza, four cheese. Thank you, sir. Have a seat. It's a big problem. I 
How do I get rid of these things? You have unpaid bills. Pay them on time. If you don't pay your current bills before the next ones come in, you'll be assessed a penalty. Bills pay. Right, bills paid. I think we're losing money here. We got 3,438. We had like five grand before. Okay, ready orders. Take. Okay. There you go, sir. Enjoy. Hello, madam. It sounds like this place is turning into a pigsty. Pizza pepperoni. Have a seat, madam. Day three. I've only served five customers. We need to speed things up. So, if I close the restaurant and serve these two, then I can get more seats in and away we go, yeah? But I've only got three grand, so I'm going to have to be careful. I'm going to empty the restaurant first. Okay. Hello, pretty tap. Thank you, sir. Oh, you probably like your food, madam. Let me grab that for you. Bon appetit. Right, I'd say we're keeping on top of things. Definitely making some progress. Um, I could probably do with redesigning the way I've got this set up, to be honest. I'm thinking this fridge to the left, that in the middle, and that to the side. And then the same over here, and maybe the, the sink goes in the middle. And I feel like that makes more sense, potentially. I haven't said that. Got that overhead thing, haven't we? All right. Thank you very much, madam. Take care of yourself. See you next time. All right, that's that done. Let's come in here. Let's get some furniture. Let's get some more. Oh, that, they're more expensive, though. But I suspect that means we can get four people in. So, for the small amount of extra cash, let's do that. But so far, we've only had single people come in. Oh, hello. I don't know what that noise was. The trash can is empty. Let's order a garbage removal. Well, it costs less if you do it early. That's interesting. There's got to be something to get rid of this, right? Oh, yeah, let's get some ceiling stuff on the go. It's probably an unnecessary waste of money, I would say. Once you start it, you can't very well stop, because that looks worse. That's a little bit... Oh, let's be honest, the, the ceiling that's there is pretty disgusting, right? So this is an improvement on every level. Almost there. Almost done. It's cost us a lot of cash, that has.
Nearly done. Wasted so much money. God, it's, it's almost unbearable now it's so bright. Okay, lesson learnt. Don't overdo it. There's got to be something in here that gets rid of bugs and stuff, surely. Special items that could be unlocked by fulfilling orders. Okay, if I could figure out how to get access to these... Uh, then I could uh... blast. All right, let's go to management. Let's get the headhunter to come in. Motivation is good. Communication is poor. Work speed is poor. All right, so if I hire you, they pay a premium. Oh, I can't put her on that job. Okay, so I need to get another one of these. I wonder if I need two ovens or whether one oven will do. Cool. Well, that's a step in the right direction. I have enough money. Why would it go there? Because oh, because that thing's in the way. Move it ever so slightly over. Job done. Do we need an extra fridge? I doubt it. That seems a little bit silly. What's going on here? Fire inspection result. Good afternoon. My name is Inspector Lewis and I will periodically come by to check on your fire safety. Because the safety of your visitors comes first. Our rules are that you must have a minimum of three working smoke detectors for each medium-sized room. Check your smoke detectors periodically, periodically to detect any faults and replace them in a timely manner. The rest of your inspection is below. Have a great day. Your result, five out of five. Penalty, none. Cool. Well, that's pretty awesome. I didn't know that was going to happen. We got away with that. Let's open a le restaurant. And see what happens now. Got any bills to pay? No bills to pay. We have two employees now. I still don't know how to get rid of these. Guessing I need some sort of spray. Tools? Ah! That would explain it. Got there in the end. Splendid. No customers, though. Oh, hello. What can I get for you, sir? Pizza margarita. Yes, sir, Bob. And away they go. It's pretty awesome. That is pretty awesome. We now have two chefs. I use that term very loosely. Keep the place nice and clean. Say hello to the cat. 
Meow, hello cat. The roof is probably okay. And yes, we're doing a pretty good job here. But I don't think it's going to take very long to get to level 10. I could be wrong. There you go. Now we can put two orders on the go at the same time. That is so cool. Um, still only getting individual customers, though. All right, first order is up. Pizza Margarita. So there's a little icon above his head showing me what sort of pizza he wants. I bet you can give the wrong pizza to the wrong person. So you have to kind of learn what these icons are, I guess. Is that interesting? Hello, madam. How can I help you? Pizza country. There's your pizza, madam. Thank you so much. And because nobody seems to mind, I'll just sweep up under your feet whilst you sat there. How you doing, sir? You're looking very relaxed today. Pizza margarita? No problem at all. Bomb. Look at that. We are so efficient right now. I'm really quite impressed with what we've done. We're, gonna, we're a three-star restaurant already, look. Good pizza, madam. Bon appetit. Thank you, madam. Thank you very much. Please come again. Why are they always on their phone? It's so rude. Pizza pepperoni. Like a proper... Oops. Like a proper restaurant now. Your pizza, sir. Smashing it out of the park, we are. Absolutely smashing it out of the park. Looks like it's snowing. And raining all at the same time. Oh, no, the bum's back. We got $1,530. How much are we making per pizza? Not much. Pizza country. Thank you, madam. Come again. Thank you, sir. I think the UI could be improved ever so slightly. Oh my god, what pizza is this? Must be yours. Hey, congratulations. Your, pizza, your restaurant has been upgraded. Your reward money has already been deposited in your bank account. What's up, fella? weird I don't know what he was doing madam the four cheese pizza coming right up thank you your pizza sir yeah, this is kind of cool uh, I kind of like it I'm hoping there are other restaurants other you know, bigger locations and stuff. Who's this guy? Pizza Pepperoni is a customer. Okay, cool. And these guys are working feverishly in the background. We're going to have 20 customers served in no time at all. Cheese pizza. Who wanted the cheese pizza? You, madam. There you go. Thank you very much for your custom, sir. See you again. Hello, sir. What can I get for you today? Margarita. Good choice. Pizza up. One pepperoni. It's getting more difficult to work out whose order goes to who. Because I don't really pay attention where they sit. <laughs> that made me jump a little bit. <clears throat> so I'm thinking we must be running out of ingredients here. Be with you in a moment, sir. Why is he instantly gone? 
That was weird. Plenty of tables to sit at. Why didn't he sit down? Perhaps I need more of these single tables. <coughs> Excuse me. Perhaps people only sit at certain tables. It's a bit hard. Uh, food store. Let's order some of that. Some of that. <coughs> The products for dishes were less than five items are highlighted in red. Okay. See, he instantly walked out as well. Why? I obviously wasn't paying attention, but why did they walk out instantly? What? What's the problem? What's he got? Let's see what happens with this guy. Not enough products to make a dish. Ah. So I was kind of preemptively uh, resolving that problem, but not quick enough. <coughs> so let's just order in more ingredients and stop losing customers. So I almost did that at exactly the right moment. I was just a little bit too slow. Oh, will I get it in in time? There's a football player. How cool is that? With the World Cup on and such. Pizza carbonara. Coming right up, sir. Take a seat. Anywhere you like. I wonder if you'll sit at a table that's got money on it. If I haven't cleared the money away. The food store. Okay, so we're, we're pretty good. Hello, madam. Four cheese pizza. Yes, they will. They'll sit at a messy table as well. So I have to keep an eye on that. Right. Excellent. Let's get rid of this. Because that's disgusting. Now, who's this for? It's got to be for you, right? The pizza should reflect what they've ordered, I think. I have no idea who this is for. No? Is it for you? It was for you. Okay. Hello, madam. Pizza pepperoni coming right up. Your pizza, madam. Thank you. They don't move around, these cockroaches. They're very obedient. And therefore easy to clean. Hello, sir. Pizza country. Man, flipping rat. That would instantly be the end of your... Uh, thank you, madam. The end of your day's business, wouldn't it? If you had a rat... Oh, who is it for? Thank you, madam. Madam, pizza pepperoni coming right up. This is pretty intense, but also pretty darn good. Your pizza, sir. Oh, our rating's gone down, look. Pizza Country. That's pretty happy. Pizza up. There you go, madam. Thank you. Additional work. Upgrade your restaurant to receive additional orders to restore and furnish other cafes and restaurants. You'll receive cash rewards, new fittings, experience and logos for completing these orders. Open tablet and check your email. Okay. Open the tablet and check my email. Oh, hello, sir. How are you doing? Pizza Margarita.
It's a wrap. Repeats the sir. Thank you. We're smashing this out of the park. Right, open this up and look at my email. Hi, I saw you around in the Castle Lake Post. My wife and I are planning to open a cosy cafe on the outskirts of town, but don't know where to start. We need your help. We need to take out all the trash, make repairs and finish the interior. Can you help us with that? We pay, we'll pay you well. Cool, so I could just go and do that immediately. Let me just... Uh, uh, pizza carbonara. And all I've done is serve pizzas. I mean, there's a whole load of other potential uh, dishes and stuff we can serve and probably a whole new collection of Bits and bobs. Hello, sir. Four cheese pizza. I mean, we're smashing it now. We're actually making a massive profit. Thank you, sir. Come again. Absolutely smashing it out of the park. We're level four. We can nearly take a photo of the Bigfoot. I'm tempted. All right. Skills are important. Reach level five to pizza carbonara to unlock skills right that's a good idea there you go sir thank you very much let's clear that table for you madam a little bit click happy there four cheese pizza there you go, sir. Look how he's sat. He's sat cross-legged. You don't get many builders who sit like that. Hello, madam. Pizza country. Thank you, madam. Thank you very much. I'm literally just about keeping on top of this. Uh, let's get... Oh, we've got marketing. Look. Let's... Go, hang on. Garbage removal. There we go. It was half full. Hello, sir. What can I get you? Pizza pepperoni. We were just smashing it out now. This is awesome. And this is like a proper hard day's work, though. Uh... Pardon me, sir. Thank you. Hello, madam. Pizza country coming right up. We are smashing this out of the park. Right, so I'm tempted to go and have a look at this second uh, property, but I just want to get the skills first. Pepperoni, sir. Uh, there are a few things I think should be changed i don't like how quickly the footprints get muddy maybe if it's raining they should be at that intensity otherwise i think it should uh, happen a lot less often hello sir uh pizza margarita thank you so much We are super efficient, I've got to tell you. How are we doing in here? Yeah, I think we ought to... Whoa, I locked myself in. Oh my God, that was scary. I'm going to order some more stuff. Pizza Country, madam. Good choice. Pizza Country is lovely. If you've never tried it, highly recommend it. Unpaid bills. Pizza up. I'm flat out here. I am not. Hardly got a second to think. Thank you, madam. Thank you so much. Hello, madam. What can I get for you? Four cheese pizza. Thank you. Thank you. Right. Let's order some stuff. So it looks like we're pretty good.
just order a whole bunch of stuff that uh, people need. Carbonara. There you go, madam. Sorry for the wait. Come on, we must be nearly level five now. Goodness me. So close. Sorry about that. Okay, take the money and bugger off. Much quicker and easier to deal with you in that way. Right. Let's get some of this food put away. Margarita, madam. Coming right up. Apologies for the uh, incorrect order there, sir. Enjoy your meal. You're so close to level five. So close to level five. Hello, madam. What can I do you for? Margarita, excellent choice. Please take a seat. I'll bring your food over as soon as it's ready. Or just after. And okay, Margarita, that's going to this lady. Just clean up around you. Splendid. Hello, sir. What can I get for you? Another Margarita. Very popular today. There you go, madam. Thank you so much for your patience. Thank you, madam. Come again. <coughs> oh, the football guy's back. Look at this. Pizza Carbonara. Look at that bin sorted out. That was 90% full. Good lord. Food is up. So yeah, this is level one. I imagine this is going to get a lot more difficult. A lot more difficult. There you go, sir. Margarita, madam. Just take that. Thank you very much. Carbonara. That must be for you, sir. Enjoy your meal. Hello, madam. Four cheese pizza. Coming right up. We are nearly level five. We are like half a blink away from level five right now. And we're making profit, which is nice. Yeah, madam. Yay! All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to close the restaurant. That makes that guy go away. We'll get the last of our orders out, and then I can put a few more seats in and do a few more bits and bobs. There you go, madam. Thank you so much. Fantastic. Well, I'd say we smashed that out of the park completely. Absolutely destroyed it. Well done, everybody. Can I come into management? And let's pay everybody a premium. That's going to speed up everything, isn't it? But we've also unlocked... Skills are very important. Reach level 5 of your restaurant to unlock the skills section in your tablet and get familiar with it. Skills. 
Right, master. Increase the speed of equipment repair. Increase the speed of your staff. Communication master. Your staff will be able to suggest customers buy an additional dish more often, increasing profits. The restorator. Increases the amount of reputation the restaurant receives. Raises the cost of orders from the email that you are fulfilling. Utility benefits. Lowers the price of utilities. Well, I'm guessing that one makes sense. Um, oh, look. There's like multiple levels. Get out of the way. I can't click on it. Look. There we go. We've got 182 skill points left. We've ranked up on everything except for barter. Which is not the end of the world, I don't think. But, uh, yeah, I think we've done a good job here. We've got a happy cat. We've got happy bums. We've got outside toilets, which is disgusting. Uh, there he is. Look, he's right there. I just need a photograph of him. But I can't do it till I get to level 7. It's a smidge annoying. Um... Right, let's jump into the next one just to take a look. So, I mean, this is an easy recommendation. This is a fantastic game. Cafe Owner Simulator, really, really impressed. Um, this is easy to recommend, and I barely even touched, I barely even scratched the surface, it feels. I'm sure there's a lot more stuff here. More visitors usually come at the weekends. Be prepared. One needs to be done remove debris restore anything that's broken create an interior decor that fits the cafe good luck to you so here we are a whole brand new location same system and that's cool because i mean a lot of the fun is just going around and fixing these places up and starting a new business i mean that is part of the fun right I think it's pretty cool. They do levitate though, so there's no physics to any of this stuff. Not that that's a big deal either. Just an observation. Let's go get rid of more crap and then we'll empty the bin. The only thing I haven't figured out how to do is access those cans that I keep finding. Oh, hello. All right, automatically, automatically swaps to uh, the tool you need. I was going to suggest that as a recommendation because it didn't seem to be working. Maybe now it has uh, maybe part of the skills that I've just unlocked allows me to do that, so that's cool. Fixing the place up nicely. Oh, even some of those are not in the best health. Look. I didn't realise that. So I've probably missed a few. There was one. Can't really visually see what's wrong with them, but something was, clearly. How cool is this? It's a shame you can't climb up on the roof properly, but it's not the end of the world. This is such a quality game. I'm really impressed with this. And one of the best things, I mean, there's a few micro bugs, nothing serious, but... Um, Everything just works really well, really efficiently. Um, yeah, I think it looks great. And the performance is excellent as well. There's no stutters or anything like that. We're absolutely smashing it. Oh, hang on. 
why have all my tools gone? That's not on. That's a bit cheeky. We're back to having no tools whatsoever. Not a fan of that, to be honest. I suppose it does elongate the gameplay, so things and roundabouts. And I like as well that um, in this particular mission, they're not like hounding me to do stuff. It's like, you know what you need to do. Just get on and do it. Oh, look, you can open that up and start renting it out to people. That is very cool. Let's get... Oh, I can't get... I can't get the bins emptied. That's interesting. Weird how it's all over the walls. Oh, I can't get it off the wall. How do I get it off the wall, then? Oh, that's interesting. Okay. That's different. Right, let's fix the windows. Wow. I didn't realise you could do that so quickly. Right, what can I do then? Can I do... A bit of that. Uh... Wallpaper. Let's go for... This looks nice. Okay, that hasn't got rid of that stuff. That's a problem. So I've got zero dollars. This is interesting. I thought I was getting paid four grand for this. Or four grand was the budget to get it up and running. Apparently not. Um, yeah, I'll be honest. I don't quite know what to do now. Uh, how do I get this stuff off the walls? None of that seems to do anything. T. Complete the task. Task panel is T. Ah... Cleaning, 94%. Walls, floors and ceiling. Okay, so how do I get... How do I get this off the wall, though? Not with a rake, obviously. Right, let's... Uh, let's do the floors. Let's go for a dark floor. Kind of filthy, but whatever. We'll call it rustic. Hmm. 
Now what? Ceiling. Horrible combination, I know, but uh, I don't know. It also kind of works. It actually does kind of work. I don't know why. Contrast, that's why. They play off each other. The floor, the ceiling and the walls. Individually, they're awful, but you put them together and they kind of work. Right. So the interior is not done. I need four tables. This is weird. It's too close to the door. A little bit clunky when you're putting stuff down, but I mean, not terrible, I suppose. What else do we need? Cash register. Uh, we need a kitchen table. Let's do the kitchen stuff first. Kitchen table. And we need a few of these. going to need an oven. It doesn't stipulate whether you need a good oven or a bad oven, so... I don't have to plug it in. Oh, that's interesting. Okay. So they also need a fryer, which is something we haven't had before. Why is that being so picky? Why well, let me put it there for some reason? Right, let's get the fryer. What does a fryer look like? Need a grill. Need some bloody ventilators, but I can't put them in for whatever reason. It did go green moment. I got one in. Open it aside. Right, that'll do. Pretty much that covered. Uh, we need a refrigerator. Oh, it says we need two ventilation. Okay. So we can't get away with that. Uh, refrigerator. Um, I don't think I could... I don't, at some point that went green, but... I don't think I'm going to get away with it again. Maybe. Maybe we get lucky. Oh, yes. That'll do. Okay. Gravy. What else do we need? A sink. 
go for a double sink. I think that's a good idea. And an ice cream maker. Damn it. That's awkward. It's down the bottom somewhere. Ice cream maker. Squeeze in that cap. Not quite. Not quite. Right, it's going to have to go sort of there ish. That's all right. That's workable. Yeah, we could deal with that. That's all good. Uh, cabinets. Oh, I need a cabinet. That's a shelf. That's a shelf. What's a cabinet then? That says kitchen shelf. That says kitchen shelf. Is it really a cabinet? I think it is. Install kitchen cabinets to increase the speed of your kitchen staff. The closer the cabinet is to the workspace, the faster your cafeteria audios will be filled. That's perfect, then. Right. Decor and entertainment. So we need a cash register. That'll do. And... It's only going to be a small cafe, this one, isn't it? Looking pretty good, though. Lamps. Lamps, 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 lamps. There you go. Not too light, not too dark. Decor, decor, decor. Pictures? Are we talking pictures? Where the bloody hell am I supposed to put these? It's not going to work. Decor, decor. Ah. Is there a way to hang a picture? Entertainment. So that's got to be a game machine, right? Nice jukebox will work. Is that decor enough? That's entertainment, not decor. So I am going to have to put a bloody picture up, I think. Which just seems crazy. Because there's nowhere to put anything. Yep, definitely want some pictures in here. It's kind of funny. How do you know if they're a big picture or a small picture? Oh, well, I've seen that picture a few thousand times. There we go. Is that it? 98%. What have I not done? Cleaning. Oh, so I've got to get this off the wall. Where the hell did that thing come from? All that time. Must be a little bit that I've missed. Oh yeah, here. It's got to be it, right? Progress, 100%. So, where's the sponge on there? There's no sponge. That really threw me a curveball, that did. C, to complete the task. Yeah. the game C yeah close I don't know if I did good or bad there cleaning 100% toilet zero I didn't see toilet on the list though okay maybe I just have to think outside the box and do it myself anyway so is this now going to take me back to my own restaurant and pay me four grand? Maybe that's what's going to happen. That's pretty 
bloody awesome game. I like this. There's a lot of good games coming out from these guys. I highly recommend you check them out on Steam. I am super impressed with Cafe Owner Simulator. It's a really good game. I've really enjoyed playing it. And um, yeah, I recommend it wholeheartedly. Thanks for watching, guys. I'm going to wrap up there, I think. Oh, hello, another cat. That looks like my old, my current cat, my first cat. But I can't click on this cat. So I bet that cat's a problem cat. Why can't the cat catch the, the rat? It's, there's a question for you. Answer me that, tongue twister. Uh, skills. So we can now barter. Excellent. Uh, increase the speed of your staff. Increase the speed of repairs. I'll do that yet. I can almost do that, but not quite. Hello, cats. Okay. So the new cat is happy. Marketing. Okay. So I turn these on and it's costing me money. Okay. So that costs me $67 a day. But it'll bring in more customers. And we're at level 5 already. This is pretty good. Uh, I bet there is more to the game. I bet there is. But unfortunately, that is way too bright. Uh, let's sell that. Let's sell that, because that is just blowing my eyeballs out, that is. We'll get some new lamps in here. Even that's quite bright. It's just too bright, isn't it? My word. Okay, um... Should we get some decor? Wow, it's a big picture. Big picture requires a big wall. And you'll notice that the light doesn't light that up as much as I think it perhaps should be picky now but uh you know that's the whole point of a review guys is to identify the good points and the not so good points but overall massively impressed really think this is a great game really like it that there's britain canada <coughs> croatia china spain france germany i'm showing my ignorance here brazil or my football uh understanding is that uh ukraine america okay there's a whole bunch of stuff there there's a lot of content there's a lot of varying different things and bits and bobs and stuff that you could buy which is really cool i like it i do like it i think it's brilliant drill ah a drill but theoretically we could repair things with the drill no? Who knows? There's a lot more to learn about this game, I think. I'm not sure how many more tables we could squeeze in here comfortably. A few more, maybe. But we have never filled this up yet, so yeah, maybe that's not really a big problem. Oh my god, how many cats are there? Random. Totally random. How much produce do we have? We're pretty full up. Not completely full up, but pretty full up. Uh, marketer skills, golden banks. Have a look. The interest rate on the loan is 30%. If you do not repay the loan on time, I don't want a loan. Don't need a loan. Statistics. Sales statistics. Okay. Interesting. Interesting. 
Now, what I could do is add something like fries. I was thinking fries. No, I can't do fries. Okay. Well, I could do mash. Could I do mash? I could do burgers, pizzas and burgers. Big Mac. My word, how do they get away with that? <laughs> That's brave. That's very brave. All right. Um, yeah, I think we're done. I think I think I've shown enough of the game to show showcase that it's really good. If you know how to access these cans, please tell me because I'd really like to know. You know, there's some there's some points there that I could get access to that I can't get access to. What the hell is this? It's like a bee suit or something. Bit random. All right. Anyway, massive thumbs up. Really good game. Definitely leave me a thumbs up as well because it's been a fun video. I've enjoyed making it. And uh, hopefully this is a game that you'll be interested in buying as well. Till next time, take care of yourselves. Goodbye for now.